Hello again, readers. It's Leanne, the editor here of Cake Decoration and Sugarcraft magazine. I'm very happy as I've just taken my first piece of cake lace by Claire Bowman, which I've got from the Cake Decorating Company. I did a video earlier of uh, all my shopping that I treated myself to at the Cake and Bake Show. I've wanted to make cake lace for a long time, but I uh, hadn't treated myself. So today is the day. This is the Ophelia mat, and I've used the rose gold ready-made up cake lace. Really easy, and look at the finish I've got. Now I spread this onto the mat using a spreader, but this was my first go, and I also did it whilst holding my mobile phone and talking to you guys, so not exactly concentrating. And the fine detail has really come out, and you can see as well how reflective the rose gold is. It's fabulous. I've got it in natural light here in front of my window on a bit of a dull day and it's still really pretty. So this was um, cooked at a very low heat in the warming oven at the bottom of my Arga. And then I've also got a piece that I've put into my airing cupboard to air dry um, to see the difference because apparently you can't use a gas oven, you can't get them low enough. So it's an electric oven, air dry, or you can use the bottom of an arga like I have. Um, so yeah, let's see how I've got on with my Hessian design mat, which has been air drying. Right, so now I have the air dried mat, which is a larger mat. Um, it's the Hessian design. This is air dried for longer, about an hour. Um, I think you can leave it for much longer than that, but it's naturally happily peeling away because it's a very warm day and I've got an argo on, so my kitchen is a very warm spot. And as you can see, it's peeling away brilliantly. The Hessian actual design is great. And it's only let down by my inexperienced spreading where when I have removed excess, I was so worried I was taking too much away that I have left spots, so instead of having a see-through grid, I've got an element of gold there as well. But I'm pretty confident I can still use this and wipe away some excess with a paintbrush gently. But that's amazing. I used hardly any of the sugar paste, the sugar lace, sorry, from the cake lace rose gold ready mixed pot so there's still loads in there to do lots more mats and I would say that's just as good as the Ophelia mat which was baked in the Argo in the heating oven this mat has come out just as well and that has been air dried with no oven necessary so there you go, cake lace, my new addiction. Do send me pictures of how you get on with your cake lace mats. I'd love to know the clever ways you guys are all using it to decorate your cakes, cupcakes and cookies. Um, I can see myself spending a lot more money with a cake decorating company because this is just so satisfying to make. So yeah, send me pictures. Speak to you soon, bye.